Thank you, Chairman, and Dr. Mark from Estonia. This is a Sungyeon Choi from Babuada Hospital, Busan, South Korea. Uh, as you know, pedicle is the key anatomy of spinal surgery. What is the UB for this question? I would like to answer this is the endoscopic solution for the spinal stenosis. Uh, UB can be performed under the general epidural anesthesia with the patient in front position for the equipment, zero degree endoscope, RF device, irrigation system, and the surgical specific, uh, and the surgical tool specific to the UB system should be prepared in the set. Codal entry is for the instrument and cranial entry for the endoscope. After serial dilation, and working space uh, is made. Scope is inserted. Lamina is exposed. This area is uh, initial working space called the sonjo, sonjo space. I always emphasize on the, on the continuous output. Uh, this video is a basic procedure of UV decompression for the central stenosis Exilateral and contralateral ligament problem is removed. This is the ULBD state. Uh, potential space uh, name, name as uh, sound space is converted into initial working space for UV procedure. Uh, paramedian approach is the two subtype and the basic approach is the paramedian approach and the paraspinal approach. This slide show migrating pattern in Lumba HIVD. I present how to Lumba HIVD according to uh, approach type. Uh, the skin point is important. Uh, on the CM radiograph, you can see check the skin point uh, in lateral view. The indicator is middle portion of a spinous process, uh, and two skin points are three centimeters apart from each other. Uh, in AP view, initial target point is a uh, spinal lamina junction. This case is a central huge uh, HIVD case. Uh, in endoscopic view, this is root uh, and the remnant ligament problem, huge disc. Uh, first of all, MRI show complete uh, removal disc. Uh, I try to spare to ligament problem as soon as possible. Uh, this case is a central huge HIVD combined the central stenosis. First, the ULBD is done, and then discectomy is done. First of MRI shows ULBD and the discectomy state. This is bilateral HIVD, bilateral imperial migrated case. Uh, I choose the paramedial approach. First, uh, ULBD is done. After that, ipsilateral and contralateral discectomy is done. Uh, first, I want to show complete disc removal. This case is the right huge HIVD combined central stenosis case. Uh, let the parameter approach is chosen. Uh, first, ULBD and next, discectomy. This is post of MRI. Uh, contralateral approach has two types. The one is a sublamina and the, the other is a translamina. If the case is a superior migrated case, uh, contralateral sublamina approach is chosen. If the case is, is imperial migrated case, uh, contralateral translamina approach is chosen. This case is L45 left superior migrated case disc, contralateral subramen approach choosing in light standing. First, I check the L4 pedicle and the removal disc. post MRI show removal of disc. Uh, this case is left L3-4 imperial, imperial migrated disc. 
컨트롤 라테랄 센스 라민 어프로치즈 튜어드닝 라이트 스탠드 레프트 사이드 리가마트 플라버 오브 L4 라미나 is detached naturally and then pedicle is checked and the ruptured disc is removed. Uh, post of MRI show removal of disc. This case MRI show right inferior migrated disc and the uh, uh, right uh, L5S1 foraminal bulging disc. Contralateral subramin approach is chosen in left standing and right side ligament problem of S1 upper ramen is detached naturally and then pedicle is the checked. Rupture disc is removed and right side L5S1 bulging disc is shrinked by RF device. First of all, MRI showed uh, removal of disc and sparing of ligament plug. Uh, paraspinal approach. This is paraspinal approach. Uh, at lateral indicator rotate, located directly above foramen. And in AP view, indicator rotated 1 cm lateral to vertebral body. The initial target point is uh, lateral. End of is smooth and below, just below pedicle. After this area burning out and the ligament problem is detached naturally in row board of transverse process. Uh, in foraminal stenosis, the three pre post ganglion part must be free. If see lateral paraspinal approach is able to be free three part, but if combined central stenosis is in, uh, if central stenosis is combined, uh, I recommend the contralateral paramedian approach. This approach is able to be solve central stenosis with foraminal stenosis. MRI shows right foraminal and extra foraminal HIV. Uh, if see lateral paraspinal uh, approach can be solved. Uh, after ligament problem <coughs> is removed and the ruptured disc is removed. We must check the ruptured disc in front of root because uh, pathophysiology of foramina HIV is uh, about the migration. And post of MRI show removal of this. Uh, this is left L3 for superior migrated HIV case. Uh, contralateral lateral approach can be solved, but upper rumba ramina is narrow than low rumba. Uh, another option is ipsilateral paraspinal approach. This is endoscopic view, ruptured disc is seen. Uh, MRI shows a full decompression. Uh, past history is a previous open discectomy and uh, recurred HIV case. Uh, in division case, uh, first checkpoint is finding pedicle. First checkpoint is a pedicle and the root is already located in the middle side of a pedicle and both adhesion tissue and pleura are retractly, retracted together and then ruptured disc is removed. A post of MRI show completely removed. Uh, many degenerative diseases have multi-level problem. This is L5 spondylolysis spondylolysis with, L, with right L3 for formula HIV disease. Uh, after cage insertion using UV is inserted in L5S1, right uh, paraspinal approach in L45 is done. Uh, endoscopic view show foramina hard disk. Uh, post op MRI. 
and post of X-ray. And next case, uh, L45 spondylolysis uh, with L5S1 right extra foraminal HRV. Uh, initial target point is uh, junction of uh, ALLA and L5 transverse process uh, after blocking and removal of ligament problem. Hard disk and soft disk are removed using osteotom and RF device and pituitary process. Root is free. Uh, post of X-ray and post of MRI. And uh, <coughs> Last case is L45 spondylolysis, S1 spondylolysis with L2 sleep left inferior migrated disc. Two level fusion using UV, and then uh, this case is the contralateral translamine approach. First, I want to show the complete uh, decompression of the skin. Uh, conclusion A type migrated pattern. Uh, paraspinal approach, transpacetal, contralateral approach can, is able to be solved. And imperial migrated pattern, uh, paramedian, transpacetal, contralateral, transamine approach. And the extra polaminal disc, uh, paraspinal approach can be solved. Uh, polaminal HIVD, contralateral sublamina, or uh, Upper lumbar case is the paraspinal approach is chosen. Uh, superior migration disc, uh, paraspinal approach, and contralateral transverse subramen approach is chosen. Conclusion uh, UV is no restriction of a surgical application of from HIVD to spinal fusion. Uh, UV is maintained the benefit of minimal invasive and powerful surgical solution for multi-level spinal stenosis and HIVD. Uh, these are spine doctors in our hospital. Uh, many domestic and foreign doctors come to run UVA. Uh, thank you, Dr. Malcolm Pestonji, and thank you, Dr. Anand, uh, Anand Dikabi, and uh, UV India. Thank you. Thank you so much. It's a pleasure to see you again. <laughs> that was a wonderful time. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you.